welcome dear students this is dr adi here and you are watching medical globe by dr adi uh, dear students today's topic is from biochemistry that is the properties of the triacylglycerol or triglycerides i have already uh, discussed this topic in my previous video uh, about the triglycerides how triglycerides are formed and their structure their types so today the properties of the triglyceride will be discussed the first property is the hydrolysis in hydrolysis a triacylglycerol is simply hydrolyzed because you know in triacylglycerol there there is one there is one glycerol one glycerol and this glycerol is connected by with the three fatty acids one two three fatty acid combined with one glycerol this is called as acyl triglyceride so when you hydrolyze it if for hydrolysis you have the enzyme that is lipase and this enzyme will hydrolyze them step by step when finally it will give us a glycerol and three fatty acids separately this is the first so it is from the digestion point of view this is also important uh, that when the fats are stored in the body so whenever these stored fats are released they need hydrolysis without hydrolysis the stored fats cannot be released from the stored sites second we have the saponification saponification is actually the, the the formation of soap you people will be wondering that how a soap is formed so actually whenever we uh, want to make soap we need an alkali called sodium hydroxide here is a, a triacylglycerol once again as i write glycerol so glycerol is linked with uh, with a three fatty acid it is linked with three fatty acid okay so this is our triacylglycerol when we combine this with the three sodium hydroxide three sodium hydroxide means there are three sodium atoms and three OH groups these three OH groups will come and break this bond so that the three fatty acids are now free and then what will happen the three sodium ions will come one of the sodium ion will come attached with this fatty acid the second with this and third with this and what will form here a glycerol is free now and then we have three fatty acid as we write a fatty acid r c o o h we write fatty acid like this so this time when three sodium are attached then what you will need to write uh, to do here you just write n a r c o o n a this is called as the soap similarly we have another fatty acid it also become r c o n a and r c o o n a so three soap molecules are produced this process is called as saponification the third one is the rancidity you might have heard you might have seen sometime the fats in our home they 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 get a, a very bad smell with with time uh, especially if you expose it to air for a long time then they develop a very a, a, an unpleasant smell this production of unpleasant smell is called as rancidity of the oil or fats rancidity and this process usually happen in in un, unsaturated fatty acid because we we know fats are of two types saturated and unsaturated so this usually occur in unsaturated fatty acids how you have an unsaturated fatty acid means between the carbon carbon somewhere there is a double bond this is such kind of fatty acids called unsaturated fatty acid of course there is coh group also present so when such unsaturated fatty acid is exposed to air moisture light or bacteria even because of the exposure to these things the fatty acid will convert into either 
it become an acid which develop bad smell or it will become an aldehyde it, it has a, it also has a bad smell or sometimes it also become a ketone so these three products are actually a come from the fatty acid and these three products are unpleasant products these are unpleasant products so these are responsible for the bad smell and if you want to protect you protect it from air moisture and light the last one is the antioxidant if you want to uh, prevent this process you will add antioxidation antioxidants that is vitamin e gallic acid bha bht the bha stands for butylated hydroxy anisole butylated hydroxy you can write this on your page thank you for watching the video thank you and love is